Hello children, how are you all? Hope so you are doing good. Yes, I know that many of you are very seriously preparing for your uh, final exam. Many of you have got the results of your uh, pre-boards. Many of you have done well and many of you are not done well. Right children? Not to be worried at all. I am here to make you to get good marks. Please follow the instructions, whatever I am going to tell you in this video. Nobody will stop you scoring very good marks children. Clear children? So now let us begin the video. Here I am with the sum of the very guarantee questions whichever are going to appear in your final exam. If you are being perfect with all these kind of questions, definitely, trust me children, definitely you are going to get a very brilliant marks. Clear? So now, first of all, out of all the chapters, whatever you have uh, okay, come across in your uh, maths textbook, First of all, I expect you to be very, very perfect with the, some of the concept like finding the mean, okay, mean by all the three methods, okay, all the three methods, definitely one four marker question is going to come from this concept. It is guaranteed, children. either they will ask you to find out the mean by direct method or by shortcut method or by step deviation method clear i hope so uh, this method all all the three methods are not so difficult for you okay not much trick is involved yes or no children only need, thing is you need to be perfect with the calculations and remember the columns right so easily scoring and the second one i expect you to be perfect with is a median okay how are you going to find out the median children by drawing the ujjayi Right, frequency will be given to you. You are going to find out the cumulative frequency column. Then plot the upper limit of the class interval as well versus the cumulative frequency. Upper limit of the class interval should be on the x-axis and cumulative frequency should be on the y-axis and plot them and draw to get a smooth curve and find out the median and quartiles, interquartile range and all the sub questions. That is going to be a guarantee question must be and 98.9999.99% it is going to happen from the section A itself. Okay. So next one is the mode. Okay. It is also a very simple. You are going to find out the mode by histogram. Clear, right? Draw the histogram and identify the modal class and find out the mode. So definitely a three three mark questions it is going to appear. Then after mode is a missing frequency, right? So they will give you the mean of the given data, class interval frequency, right? And either one or two missing frequency they will ask you to find out depending upon one or two questions. I mean missing frequencies marks are allotted so minimum three marks you take it for this question okay missing frequency three mark right so in the next concept and a very important concept is a reflection okay so very very simple concept you need to reflect the given point in the x-axis or y-axis and also name the closed figure okay name the closed figure depending upon the number of side it has always have that habit okay don't name the closed figure as kite star no okay name them as quadrilateral name them as a uh, hexagon concave pentagon okay depending upon the number of sides if you don't know a six sided polygon is called as hexagon or eight sided polygon is called as octagon not necessary okay not necessary to name them as nanogon decagon octagon just name it as a, a concave octagon i mean concave eight sided polygon marks will be given to you clear no worry at all a uh, convex five sided polygon okay you can write like that also marks will be given to you right so this is also a five marker guarantee question then after reflection it is a quadratic equation okay so here quadratic equation finding the roots of the given quadratic equation by formula method and rounding of the 
final answer to given significant figures or given number of decimal places right so this is guarantee question it will be asked a minimum for three marks it can be asked for four marks as well minimum we are talking about right so the next one is uh, matrices i don't think so the matrix chapter is uh, difficult for you okay matrix multiplication addition okay what is identity matrix finding the order of the matrix finding the values of x and y which are the elements of the matrix okay so very simple concept minimum you can take it as a three or four marks i can take right so four marker will be asked on this later comes the construction usually what they do construction and low side together they will ask okay they will combine these two and ask a question it will be for four marks okay construction means construction of in circle circum circle or tangents to the given circle i have made a video okay you can watch it and learn it all the things okay all the types of constructions from the video that is a four marker guarantee question so after construction we have a banking okay so that is nothing but uh, finding out the i that is interest or maturity value or principal or i may ask you to find out the number of installments where you are going to get a quadratic equation right so very simple if you okay a little bit spend up time on this chapter very simple it is not so much trick is involved so the next one is uh, the 10th chapter is uh, gst right so where the table will be given to you or the transaction between the two guys are given to you okay you need to find out the gst and make sure that if it is a intrastate transaction that means what within the state transaction you need to mention what is sgst and cgst clear so many of you are going to calculate the gst directly don't have that habit okay sgst and cgst separately to be written that will also carry some weightage clear children okay so that is going to minimum i can say it is for a three mark clear so next one the 11th one is a probability okay very simple concept it is again probability you are asked to find out the probability of finding the even numbers getting even number in a single throw of dice right so different varieties of questions right uh, till now we did not get any questions from a, a deck of playing cards right but don't ignore them practice or two three questions you practice that is also a very simple concept okay you can easily score the marks clear children so now if you add all the marks whatever i have written here see observe here 4 plus 5 9 9 12 12 15 20 23 27 31 31 plus 10 41 children see your marks is going to be 41 out of 80 clear children if you are not at all studied full chapters all the chapters you are not studied okay minimum i am talking about 41 marks out of 80 okay so rest of the chapters like uh, reminder and factor theorem or you may be having circles or similarity or ap gp okay it is not like you don't know anything about them if you have not scored all four marks all three marks okay at least you may attempt the question rightly you may get one mark here one mark there one mark another place okay all that together will give you another 10 15 marks so I am not at all talking about that 10-15 marks, minimum 41 marks I am talking about. So your teachers will be so kind that they will minimum give you 17 or 16 marks out of uh, 20. If you have done a wonderful project or your the continuous uh, assessment throughout the year is very nicely you have performed okay so you will definitely get uh, more than 17 as well so now in worst cases i am talking about 41 plus 70 uh, 17 right so what uh, what is your score children it is going to be 58 on 100 it is going to be the minimum score i am talking about so scoring marks in icsc is not at all a big deal it's not a rocket, rocket science right so don't lose your confidence right even if you start studying from this point of time okay and you are perfect with only these concepts whatever i have mentioned in the today's video okay so your score will be 58 minimum on 100 clear okay in the rest of the chapters you may score 
another 10 15 marks that is a bonus right so minimum 58 55 marks is a very very guarantee for you clear so i hope so that today's video is very very helpful to you boost your confidence and start preparing if you are not yet started clear children so take care keep working bye bye and don't forget to subscribe the channel thank you take care bye bye